So right here you can see uh, in the foreground the three departing crew members, uh, Sergei Rozanski on the left there, Oleg Kotov in the middle, and uh, just floating to the back uh, in the gray jumpsuit is Mike Hopkins. So right here you can see uh, in the foreground the three departing crew members, uh, Sergei Rozanski on the left there, Oleg Kotov in the middle, and uh, just floating to the back uh, in the gray jumpsuit is Mike Hopkins. Uh, the three were loading into their Soyuz TMA-10M spacecraft. See Mike Hopkins, NASA astronaut, giving a quick wave farewell there. The astronauts loading into the craft. Uh, this view from inside the Poisk module in the Russian segment. Rosansky will be uh, in the uh, left seat of the craft, uh, Hopkins in the right seat. And in the center will be departing Expedition 38 Commander Ale Kotov, giving a quick hug there to Koichi Wakata. The now commander of the International Space Station, who will remain on board for Expedition 39. Kotov now there, uh, moving into the spacecraft uh, from Poisk. Uh, you can see some of the Sokol launch and entry suits tucked just to the lower left uh, of the craft. And there, uh, Kotov and Rzansky giving the final wave goodbye uh, before Kotov uh, will now reach up and uh, prepare that hatchway for its final closure. This happening uh, earlier this afternoon at 3.58 p.m. Central Time. You see Kotov on the left, Mike Hopkins in the middle, uh, a little towards the back, and Sergey Rosansky on the right, waving goodbye to Mikhail Turin, Rick Mastrakio, and Koichi Okada, who will remain on board. Now the craft uh, conducting a series of leak checks, the crews uh, on board ensuring the integrity of their spacecraft as they continue to move towards the next major milestone of tonight's events, which will be the undocking of that Soyuz TMA-10 uh, from the International Space Station.